These are the keys to Karen's Kingdom. I have a couple of chains. One is the Richardson Family Crest, I believe from Ireland. And the other one came from friends when I received my doctorate and they felt like now I could get back to doing some gardening. So that tells you a little bit about me. In addition, my little tags tell you something about me. Hancock Fabrics, I'm a knitter, crafter, sewer, so I spend a lot of time at Hancock Fabrics. I shop primarily at Bloom. Notice I have two, a red and a purple. And then I'm a huge reader, and that's my library card. I live in a little town, I can walk or bike to the library, and I'm always excited to have my library card. I drive a pickup truck. Um, I totaled my station wagon last summer and my husband and I decided not to buy a new car and so I'm a girl who drives a pickup truck. It has a cap and you can lock the cap. I did that one night in a hotel lot and then I proceeded to throw the car keys on the front seat and lock the doors and managed to completely lock myself out of the truck. So I don't always lock the cap anymore. I also have a post office box in my little town. That's the post office box key. It's only recently that we've actually been able to lock our back door. So one of these keys is to the back door. I'm not exactly sure which one. I'm curious about these two keys, actually. And then I realized I have a couple of old keys from William and Mary that I should probably return, although I'm thinking that when they move to the new school of ed, those closets and cupboards probably don't exist anymore. Um, and then I think this is the key to the property. But in doing this little exercise, I have discovered that I really actually only use about four of the keys on my keychain, and I'm thinking I'm going to get rid of them. So in addition to being a creative, creative exercise, this has actually been an organizational exercise for me. So thanks very much to The Daily Create. That's the story of the keys to Karen's Kingdom.